Good morning, y'all. You can see it's kind of overcast, and it's been this way for several days, and the humidity has been so high, or at least so high for us. I'm on my way to my storage while it's still, it's 8.43. I meant to get going a little bit earlier. I always do. But um, I woke up at about 4 o'clock this morning and I could not go back to sleep. Don't you hate that? But anyway, we're headed over to the storage and I'll get as many boxes out of there as I can. There's just so many things that I need. And um, anyway, I'm not going to buy more paper towels. I'm not going to buy more toilet paper. I'm not going to buy more Q-tips when I have a lot of it already. So I'm going to get stuff like that out of there and also the attachments to my little vacuum cleaner were not in the same box, of course. But anyway, um, the van is sick. Yep, she's sick. Now, why does she have to get sick now? I just, well, let me not complain. The, um, you know that light that comes on that it's not, this one does not say check engine. It says service due or something. Now, yesterday, um, and when it comes on, all the lights on the dash come on. And then they go off. And then yesterday, I went to put it in gear, in drive, and it kind of froze up for a second. Now, it's done that once before. I think I talked to you all about that in another video when, you know, Terry and I were at a gas station and I was getting gas and it did that. Well, I checked the oil and I added oil and then I checked my gas cap because sometimes things like that will happen if your gas cap is, you know, on wonky. So, I'm going to have to make an appointment and take it to Encinitas. That's where uh, John, the gentleman I bought it from, has always taken it for service. So, y'all say a little prayer that it's nothing major. So, it is life, y'all. I mean, these things just happen. It, it just happens. And I probably should have taken it in when it very first happened. But since I put some oil in it and it was acting fine, I thought everything was okay. But obviously, it's not. Now, I want to tell y'all something funny. Hazel and I were coming out of the cottage to go to the storage and she started to walk out on the dirt now the yard is all dirt y'all she is filthy and I hesitate to give her a bath because she's just got to go back out there and after she has her bath she wants to rub herself all over the carpet and you've seen those carpets, y'all. I don't really want her to do any more rubbing on those carpets, especially when she's damp. But she was going to go out into the yard. And she was close to one of the support trellises that hold the carport up. And she started walking. And then she backed up really quick. And she started walking again, and she backed up again. Well, she wouldn't go through that way. And you know what it was that was holding her back? <laughs> Y'all, it was a spider web. It was a spider web. So, um, I just thought that was hysterical. I just started laughing, and she looked at me like, Hey, you walk through the spider webs and see how you like it. Which I do not, y'all. They creep me out. But anyway, um, what was this video about? Well, it was about the van. It was about Hazel. So, y'all have a good day. Do something fun. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.